My name's Katie Lowe and I'm from Heathfield Orchards and Cheshire West and Chester Council have asked me to come along here today to teach the local community some techniques in pruning their fruit trees and maintaining their community orchards. It's really important that communities understand how to look after their trees to produce a healthy crop of fruit in future years. So many communities plant their trees and then just do nothing to, to look after them because they don't have that knowledge. But uh, what we're trying to do, places like this here today, is to give people that understanding so that in future years they can have a nice, healthy, well pruned tree and plenty of good quality fruit. Hi, I'm Peter Bulmer, one of the councillors for Great Bolton Parish Council. A few years ago, we started looking at the heritage of our open spaces. We run about seven across the parish. And one of those here on Thackeray Drive used to be an orchard before the big housing estate in the 60s was built. So we started to look at that. At the same time, Cheshire West did a webinar about recreating community orchards. So it was an ideal time to get in touch with Quack, Cheshire West and Chester. And they had funding through the trees for climate, through into Mersey Forest and through to Cheshire West. And they paid thankfully for all the sort of the trees, a contractor planted and that was two years ago. Today we've had training about pruning fruit trees in our community orchard, which is really, really important to look after your trees once you've planted them. They were planted two years ago and they've become leggy and too high to produce really good fruit. So we've learned how to drastically but wisely cut them back and hopefully fruit in the next few years. It's been really important for us to learn how to maintain our trees. And getting the community involved in our community orchard is really important, either through individuals, or we've been in touch with a couple of businesses and they're looking at volunteering days, so we can get a team of about 10 people out pruning our trees for the next few years, which is really exciting. And then people can help themselves. We've also got apple pressing in October, bringing their own apples and using the fruit off the orchard. In Great Borton, we used to have an orchard in this area, so it's another mechanism to get our community involved in our open spaces. During lockdown, our local open spaces were really well used. Um, we've got old clay pits, old rubbish tips, old orchard areas, and it's just part of the heritage, rich heritage our local area brings together. And it's getting that across to people, getting them involved, and getting them, hopefully, all set up a friends of Thackeray Drive Community Orchard. In, in the future, so it's really exciting to get our community involved in our open spaces. 